Okay, I have a question. Um, I have gone through DHR. Um, I have a son, and um, I get child support payments. And um, in the past probably two years, his father has just, like, quit calling, quit seeing him. He used to get him every other weekend. Um, but now, I mean, I haven't heard from him or anything. I still get child support from where he works. Um, but I wanted to know, um, I wanted to see about, um, like, him signing over his rights. I know I'll probably, you know, lose the child support, um, but that's fine. I just don't want him, like, if something to ha was to happen to me and him have to go live with, you know, him, somebody that he hasn't seen in over two years. Okay. All right. What are your thoughts? Uh, that's a very dangerous issue because when you ask a person to sign over their rights, most parents won't. Mm -hmm. And it's a, it's a huge fight and a high burden to prove to get the person to deny their, their parental rights for a judge to actually... Um, deny their rights. So it's a, that's a very tough thing to do. Okay. Does she need an attorney probably to talk to an she attorney? Does. To she does need out. a lawyer to figure out exactly the procedure and to see whether he agrees to do it. Well, if, even if he doesn't sign his rights away, can she still go to court and petition? Can yes. the court do that? But the court needs to have a lot of information okay. against that person drug abuse, um, abuse of the child. Okay. Abandonment. Some kind of, yeah. Yes, something, something factual, except he just won't see it. Okay. All right.